So Huck made a video about keepsakes and the way we let go of things. I am the complete opposite. When it comes to things like that, I'm often brutally unsentimental, to the point where I'll usually bring a friend to make sure I don't make a decision I regret. All of my keepsakes would probably fit in about a medium-sized box. That includes photo albums, conference things, everything from my adult life. And I take pleasure in going through and getting rid of them. Once, I clung really hard to everything I had because I never knew if I would ever see it again. It made up all the parts of who I am. And then I grew up. And when I find those things, I take joy in remembering all of the things that they have given me. But I also enjoy closing that chapter and realizing that I don't need these things anymore to be who I am. I don't need old summer camp trophies. I don't need diplomas. I don't need my master's thesis, right? I'm past all that. I don't spend a lot of time looking back. I spend a lot of time looking forward. So things like stuffed animals and photo albums and old toys and knickknacks and keepsakes, the sort of flotsam and jetsam that you accrue over the course of a life, I enjoy letting go of especially if I can pass those on to someone who's going to have fun with them. Now the exception to this is tools. If I think I am going to use this thing in the future, well goddamn I'm never getting rid of it. I'm going to move with it nine times because I'm like, man, one day I'm going to find a use for this and it's going to be amazing. And sometimes, perhaps even often, it is amazing. But, standing here in the studio, I can look at about five objects just sort of kicking around where I'm like, these are waiting for their moment. Those are my keepsakes. I keep hold of things with potential. Because one day, I am going to use them for something. And even those have a shelf life, but it's much longer than summer camp trophies. So we can add this to the many ways in which Huck and I are completely different people. But I do think that it's valuable to cherish the moments when you let go of your past and you stop being beholden to it. Or why do? Stay awesome.